Summer is fast approaching and I know that you're looking for a performing, compliment-getting, sweet summer fragrance. So right now, here's something new. Tamarindo from Memo Paris. Now here are seven things that you need to know before you purchase this. First thing that you need to know, tamarindo, it's not a fruit. Tamarind is the actual fruit and we call it here in the Philippines, Sampalo or tamarind. But tamarindo, it is a tourist destination in Costa Rica famous for its beaches, sand, and sun. So, now you know. Okay, so what does this smell like? Pineapple at the top. Sweet, sweet, juicy pineapple. But no, it's not Aventus-ish. It will not even remind you of Aventus, okay? So, there's that. Sweet, juicy pineapple combined with the flesh of the coconut, that moist flesh you get inside the coconut paired with patchouli to remind you of the greenery around you. And the mid notes, it would be addition of jasmine. The jasmine the patchouli would give you this earthy, tropical vibe while you sip your piña colada. And going on to the base, we have vanilla, we have this pineapple, traces of pineapple actually because it has faded into the two hour stage. What we're getting for the sweetness is the vanilla. We're still getting the patchouli and lots of jasmine, which still reminds you of the tropical paradise, which is tamarindo. So for the price, this one ranges in the sub 200. I see online there are $189, above $200, $200. But locally, we have this at here, Art of Scent. And for the price to value ratio of this, we'll get into that later. Now for the uniqueness. On top of your head, name me a fragrance that resembles like Pina Colada and Tropical Paradise. Go. Yeah, that's what I thought. So this one, Amarindo, really unique. It reminds you of that Pina Colada inside this lush, tropical paradise. So it gets high scores for me, for uniqueness. So for the versatility of this, I'd recommend you use this outside, trekking, mountain climbing, beaches, but not for occasions where it's really formal. You know, this is a fun, cheery scent and doesn't suit those formal occasions like award ceremonies, closing business deals, or black tie events. No, Tamarindo is a really casual, fun scent. So I advise you to wear this really really casually and now for the longevity i get six hours on the average at other times it passes to the six hour mark it still goes to the eight hour so i got no problems with its longevity next one is projection and siage this one will project above average projection leaves a really nice and really clean sweet scent trail you will get noticed you will get complimented, that's for sure. So in conclusion, would I recommend this to you? Yes, I would, if you have the cash and if you can afford it. Because it performs, it projects, it lasts, and you don't smell like any other person. That makes you unique. For the price to value ratio, yes, I'd say it gets a passing grade, but if you can host a split with other people who are interested with this, or you can buy decants if it's available in your fragrance Facebook groups. And that's it for today. Tamarindo by Memo Paris. I hope you did enjoy and have a good image in your mind of what tamarindo really does smell like. Even if you're in the office, you would be reminded of your vacation and your adventures. So there you have it. These are just my opinions, recommendations, and suggestions at the end of the day. Yes, you do you. Don't forget to hit subscribe if you found this useful, hit the notification bell. I will see you in the next episode. Bye.